Hi, it's Katie from Coastal Kinesiology. And if you're watching this video, it is because you've shown interest in my Back to Basics program. Now I wanna talk about this program because it has been evolving over many, many years. It's been run in a few different capacities and I've made tweaks to it every single time I've run it. But what I absolutely love about this program is the foundation is the same. The foundation is about teaching you how to love and accept yourself in a very simple and easy to apply manner. And that is why the program is now called Back to Basics. It is run over six weeks. It originally started as a 40 day challenge and it was run in person back in my Clermont days in clinic and I would bring women together and for 40 days we would do mirror work. I've changed it to six weeks because I like the way the weeks became a little bit more structured. So we break it into week by week and we look at all of the different elements. So what I've created in my business is this foundation, which is the pillars of health. So if you've ever been in my clinic, you'll see this flying around the place. And this is what essentially I teach all of my clients. And this five pillars of health is the foundation, right? And this is what the program is all about. So in each week, we focus on a different pillar. The pillars of health are physical. Physical is anything about movement of the body, breath work, your sleep pattern. Sleep is so, so important. If we don't have good sleep, we cannot function effectively. So week one, we focus on the physical body. How are we moving? How are we sleeping? How do we feel about our body? Do we ever support ourselves with things like yoga and breath work and stretching and massage and all of those sorts of things? So it's exploring the relationship they have with this physical body. Then we look at the emotional body. It's about our feelings. There is not one moment of each day that we are not feeling something. So the emotional week, we start to really look at our feelings. And that's when I'll teach you about my feeling triangle. And that is how do I feel? How do I want to feel? And what is it that I need? Okay, and we'll start to use this feeling triangle to start really getting to the bottom of our feelings. We have so many feelings and a lot of the time we disassociate from those feelings. You know, we'll get on the phone and scroll or we'll put something on Netflix or we'll ring a friend and talk on the phone for a long time about things that aren't really relevant in order to avoid our feelings, right? So in this week, we'll really start to explore how to come into peace with your feelings, how to move through those pesky negative feelings. And that um, is so important because we wanna then anchor ourselves into a state of how we are wanting to feel and not getting stuck in how we actually feel. Next, we'll look at mental. So mental is anything that we think and believes. So all of those thoughts, you know, I'm not good enough, I'm not worthy, I'm fat, I'm ugly, I'm old. You know, we'll start to unpack a lot of those thought processes and how do we manage that sort of aspect of ourselves when it comes up, you know, when the thoughts become really, really loud. So that is week three. Week four, we'll start to look at nutrition, what's going in our mouth, on our skin and into our bodies. And how does that affect us? How does that make us feel? How do we view our relationship with, you know, things that we're putting in our bodies? And today it's so complicated, you know, it's Botox, it's, um, you know, collagen, lip fillers, all of that sort of stuff. It's looking at the duality of that. Is this helping or hindering me? And there's no right or wrong, okay? It's like, you know, for years I used to get my hair straightened. Now I just leave it crazy curls. But for a long time, I really questioned, was I really moving away from my authentic self when I was straightening my hair? A lot of people said yes. But I'm also a big advocate of, you know, you've got to do what feels right for your body. And this is where it's about learning our own, is it helping or hindering me? You know, it's your truth, right? And that's what this program is about. It's leading you into your own personal truth. So they're the five pillars of health physical, emotional, mental, spiritual. 
hang on. <laughs> Physical, emotional, mental, nutritional, and then spiritual. So spiritual is the belief that there is something outside of ourselves guiding ourselves, right? So it is the connection to something outside of us, believing our truth. And when we bring them all together, that's when we start to look for the balance. And week six is about balance. So week five is spiritual. Week six is about bringing it all together. So over this six weeks, what we will also be doing is every single day we do mirror work. So mirror work is, if this was a mirror, you know, we're going to be looking at ourselves in the mirror and we're going to be saying statements. So every program I allocate statements. I feel in energetically and usually they're like, I am worthy, I am enough, I am beautiful. You know, whatever um, statement feels right for the program at the time. Some of my women make their own statements. Some of them add them. They write them on the mirror. They um, get, you know, post-its and they write their affirmations and they put them around the place. So over the six weeks, you'll be doing these affirmations in the mirror. And that's the mirror work, you know. And I say it's meeting yourself every single day and learning how to show up for yourself every single day. It's so important to learn how to navigate your own internal chaos. How do you articulate? How am I feeling? What is it that I truly need in order to move through this feeling? And that's what this program is about. So for six weeks, you have the support of all of the people in the program with you. You have the support of myself and my co-facilitator, Peter, who has been running these programs with me now for quite a few years. You will also have accountability. If there is a really specific goal that you're wanting to accomplish, then you can apply that and do the program alongside your own personal goal. I've had women wanting to give up alcohol for six weeks, wanting to do keto for six weeks, wanting to um, you know, address changes in their relationships, wanting to make changes in their career. There are so many things that you can do. And I've had lots of people repeat the program because they got so much out of it because it's simple. It's easily applied. You don't need to even leave your home. We start off with a online Zoom session. So I send you the link. We all meet in a group format so that you can see the faces of everybody traveling with you for the six weeks. And we have our opening where we talk about what the expectations are of the program. We have connection. We have time together. You are then added into a private Facebook group where I'll be doing live posts and I will be feeling into the energy of the group and answering your questions. There will also be a Facebook messenger group where you'll get daily reminders. How are you traveling today? How are you feeling? What's coming up for you? And you can participate as much or as little as you like within those spaces. However, the more you stay connected, the more you get out of this. I also allocate you an accountability buddy. So that means you'll be connected to somebody else in the program. And that way you have your own little personal connection where you can say, you know what, this isn't feeling good. I don't feel great. I feel amazing. I feel really blocked, blah, 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 you know? So that you've got a few layers of accountability and a few layers of support. So that is the Back to Basics program, which I'm extremely passionate about. It's very affordable. You get two sessions with me, okay? And if you aren't in this area, if you aren't in the Yapoon area, we do them online. They're like coaching sessions with some kinesiology. We set your goals. We look at what's blocking you. We talk about what's coming up. So you get two one-on-one -on -one sessions with me. You get six weeks of accountability you get support and you get exposure to a wonderful group of like-minded people who are on the same journey as you. And it is extremely affordable. In fact, it is the most affordable way to work with me. Okay. And I can't let it go. Every time I think I'm not running this program, I know that I've got to run it because I get so much out of it. My clients get so much out of it. And it is a really genuine way to teach people the foundations of self-care and how to become equipped with the tools to do the work, to be more connected, to find ways of bringing peace and calm into their life 
and essentially that's it. So it doesn't matter where you are on your personal development journey, as long as you're willing and you're ready, okay? That's super important because I've had a lot of women especially pull out of this program halfway through because they get overwhelmed and they go, well, I didn't sign up for this. It's not hard. You just have to be willing. You have to be willing to feel the emotions. I've had women say to me, I wasn't expecting it to be this emotional. Well, it's because you're learning to sit with yourself, but you are so, so supported in this space. Okay, you will have my support, you will have Peter's support and you'll have the support of everybody else in the program with you. It's not scary, it's not hard, it's actually really easy, but you have to be willing and you have to be ready. And the differences I see in the women, and I've had men in this program that are willing and ready, the changes are astronomical. So I want you to come into my program. I wanna see you here in my space I want to have you on the journey with me because trust me, I understand it. I've overcome grief, I've overcome trauma, I've overcome struggles, and then guess what? The next one's presented. It never really ends, but what's different is now I have a whole lot more coping skills and mechanisms to get through my hardship. And I have great support networks from people that I have collected along the way through all the different trainings, coachings, and modalities that I've learned and experienced and I want to share this with you because life can get you down you can get stuck in loops but there is always a way and that's the foundation of my business my kinesiology creating pathways where there appears to be none okay if you have any questions please do reach out to me I've got women who have done my programs before already lining up to get in the doors are open. You can book your place right now. I will put a link here for you to be able to join the program. I'll be running it twice this year. The next one will be in July, 8th of July. I'm just looking at my calendar. We start on the 5th of February this year and the 8th of July is my second one. It's simple, it's effective, and it will make big, big changes please do reach out and message me if you have any questions. I cannot wait to work with you.